Well, eventually we can come back there, but um, really there's nothing for us to do, so. Because when we have to sharpen our weapons, uh, we can make them a lot sharper in uh, other places and uh, stuff like that, so. This is going to be our main goal up here, uh, the Great Hollow. Um, this is where the Lizard Clan lives. Breast Castle. Um, you're going to want to do a lot of your upgrading here because, uh, well, we can do it uh, in the Great Hollow. Um, for some reason, it makes a little more sense to do it here because uh, it's basically between... Um, the force the Zek, or force sex a and uh or sex force or whatever and uh pure uh, this is the other area um the yaza plane um now the difference between um sex force and the yaza plane um when you're grinding um the yaza plane has a few more enemies that are worth a little more experience and a little more potch. However, um, they don't show up all the time. Um, and two, um, you get more skill points down in uh, Zekto Forest. And you might want to grind here first anyway because uh, you can always uh, pick up some medicines here and uh, you really can't up there, so... Plus, as I said before, uh, this is probably a better spot to grind for some skill points, so. Because that's one of the things you're really in need with them is to upgrade their skills. Um, of course, because you're going to be doing so much grinding anyway, um, you're going to be gaining a couple of levels. Um, the... Unfortunately, though, uh, I don't think that uh, either of these two areas will have dark rabbits for us. Plus, um, here, um, there are no upgraded versions of the enemies or anything like that. So, just uh, like verbinators, regular hollies, and stuff like that. Um, plus, you do want to be careful because uh, you can still get into some random boss battles here, so... show up the uh, first one here so um I can hopefully show off a uh, couple of these um kind of special attacks so for some reason um when you have ghetto and uh um Jockus in the same group um I think it's probably the same thing if you uh Replace Ghetto with Queen, um... For some reason, um... When Jockus does Baronda Hawk, um... Ghetto, um, will just not move, um... If one of the enemies kinda comes up close to him, uh... will just swing his sword, but... Um... He won't, uh... Take part in the battle, like, initially, so... And... Of course, uh, we can only access uh, one of these things at a time, so we can't have uh, both Baronda Hawk going and uh, also be starting to cast lightning, so. Okay. Double Tusk, um, as you can see, um, really doesn't have a very large effect area and. Uh, of course, because it loses balance, um, I really don't like using it that much, but, um, when they come out for Mercenary A, um, larger effect area, um, of course, um, Ace loses balance, and, that uh, because it is a combination of, uh, both Ace's one and, uh, um, also, the fire magic from, uh, 
for Joker there, um, if you are fighting enemies that really aren't weak to fire or fire doesn't do anything to them anyway, um, then I would just avoid using this, so. And, uh, with Queen, um, Ripple, um, only affects one enemy at a time, um, Uh, usually, um, Brondahawk will, uh, go first, so... As I said, uh, Brondahawk is, uh really good to start off with, so... Good. Oh, not bad. Mr. C and B. As I said, uh, this area is really good for, uh, for getting some medicines. Um, one thing I should also say about the area of me, um, we run into, uh, spiders there, uh, I think they're arachnivores, um, which can, of course, uh, poison us, so, you know, why stick around up there and, uh, hopefully somebody will, uh, drop an antidote for us, or... Or whatever, but usually we have to go into like a brass castle or whatever and actually buy us um, some antidotes. And you know, um, you kind of want to keep your pouch around for um, sharpening your weapons, so. Ghetto will um, actually search dead bodies. Yeah, that happens every once in a while, um, let's say somebody beat me to it, um, just means that, uh, usually somebody in, uh, one of the other chapters, uh, picked up, uh, stuff here, so, um, these dead bodies, um, they will have, uh, stuff that we can pick up later on, um, like they will, uh, eventually come back, so, well, not the person, but, um, the actual items that they had, so... I don't know if, uh... If it's just the, uh, items that come back, or... If they're considered, like, uh... Another person actually died the same spot, or, or what, so... Five holly shrubs. And I was just able to take them out with, uh, Broda Hog. Um... I think I will uh, be waiting until I get into my second area uh, before I show off what uh, Mercenary B is like, so. Because when I do Mercenary B, um, some, I think uh, two of the characters actually uh, become unbalanced. I think it's, uh, um, it's either Ace and Joker or Ace and uh, Queen, so. I kind of want to avoid that, at least uh, for the time being. Four holly shrubs and uh, two holly elves. So, nobody gained a level for me that time, but let's see. Three vermineers, and uh, I got a medicine B for it, so. There's also um, another person up here in uh, the forest eventually. Um, he's one of the characters that really isn't involved in any of the battles. So, if you really want to, um, you could pick him up with like a, with ghetto, um, 
I don't believe that I will be able to get the thing that he's looking for in this chapter, though, so... Um, yep. I think these things might actually kind of uh, increase in power. Um, we kind of leave them alone for at least one chapter or come back later in the chapter or whatever, so. Two Verminators. Um, they'll also um, kind of come back eventually, um, kind of like uh, those bags by the dead bodies. Um, they will eventually be back here, but um, it's kind of a random amount of time uh, in between each time, so. I don't know if uh, we pick, like, a medicine B if it takes a little longer for one to come, one to come back or, or what, but. I'm just going to be uh, picking them up here with ghetto um, just because I can, so. Okay. Not much else we have to do here. Five holly shrubs and a holly elf. Uh, not much we really have to do um, in here right now. Um, as I said, um, in one of my other files, um, I've actually come back here and I grinded for a little bit for uh, some medicines and stuff like that, so. And also some uh, extra skill points, so. Of course, uh, this, um, this place is probably the easiest to go if we uh, want to upgrade our magic skills. Um, because the one in the Great Hollow um, is kind of out of the way, I think. And, uh, plus, we'll, we'll uh, easily be able to go between uh, Zex and Forest and uh, up here with uh, Yellow Queen, so. Okay, here in Yellow Plain, um, the actual exit that we want to do is a uh, the one right to the north of us, um, the large one to the west of us, um, will lead us to another place where we gotta go, like, another screen over, and, uh, then when we, uh, actually exit out of the other plane, um, it'll just be dead end right now, so, don't go over that way, and unless you're, uh, really grinding for some levels or whatever right here, so, as I said, um, Right now, it is probably not going to be the best thing for us because of uh, the Arachnum Force um, ability to, to uh, poison us, so... But... Okay. Um, I think this is a new enemy, the Wild Boar. Um, and of course with him, um, I'll show off uh, Mercenary A, so... I was thinking about it doing Barona Hog, but... And as you can see, uh, unfortunately we only do uh, get into one enemy um, one time during battle, but um, uh, th this causes a lot of damage. Um, I think uh, for right now, um, it should cause like a... between 8 and 1100 damage, so, um, I guess, uh, that kind of depends on, uh, how sharp my wagon is, but, um, as you can see, we, we can only do one of these per battle, so. And if we had Jacques, uh, over here behind Queen, um, we still could not, uh, select his, um, Veronda Hawk or whatever, um, 
we only get the uh, actual shield, so. So it'd be kind of a waste. Got my weapons were flat low, but oh well. So it's a really good move to kind of start off with uh, his bosses. So hmm. I thought uh, two of you guys would uh, kind of be unbalanced after that, but oh well. I wonder why that didn't happen this time. And one of the other things with the uh, wild boar is that sometimes when it hits you, uh, it can cause you to become unbalanced, so... I did a little bit of level grinding and stuff, uh, in my other save file, but not as much as I really need to, uh... Four Erectivores, and, uh... As I was saying, I, I haven't gotten enough, uh, levels or skill points or whatever for, for the entire chapter, but... Yeah. Okay, um... Unfortunately, Ghetto was poisoned, uh, at the end of the battle there, um... Uh, that's going to be okay because, uh, he'll, uh, kind of lose those poison states when, uh, when I go stay at the inn over here in, uh, um, the Great Hollow, so. As you can tell, that uh, there's no sound when you lose HP, but, uh, you'll show up purple, so. But, so I go with the... Right, hello here. <laughs> 